guys, my name is Nistaku, and it has been so long since the last time I recorded anything. I think the last thing I ever did was a stream that was two months ago. Two months! <laughs> I mean, I've been editing, as you can see, like, I've been putting up videos and whatnot, but recording, I, I haven't even done it let alone just um streaming we are back in witchwood um like i said it's been two months so it's been two months since i last played witchwood uh i know we collected the cat last because i'm here with a bunch of cute little kitties and today we're gonna go to the rat but yeah there is so much to catch up on um i have this hat that that's one thing <laughs> uh what else i think you guys see me with glasses already um, ba lo lots of just different, uh, different things going on in my personal life, that's for sure. Editing will be a lot different too, because now I can actually, like, move my, my camera around on the game so you can see more, which I'm very happy about. Um, because for the streaming, it was very, like, limited. It was limited because I would record the stream. I wouldn't record, like, individually my camera and whatnot. Uh, this is- where- where- how do I get to the- I want to get to the graveyard. I don't want to do the fish. It has to be up here. Maybe I need to go to the village and then the graveyard? I don't know. Um, but yeah, I just like took a big break from streaming. I- I don't honestly know when or even if I will ever go back to streaming. I just, I, I don't know how else to say it, but I just lost enjoyment, I guess. Um, it was fun for a good period of time. And I always had my friends be like, oh, you should keep streaming. Oh, it really seems like you enjoy streaming. Um, <laughs> yeah, I wasn't. I really wasn't. Um, no, I, I appreciate everyone who came in in each stream and supported me. And seeing returning uh, people, I did appreciate that every single time. But yeah, I just, I, I lost my love for it after a bit. I think I was streaming for, I think I streamed for like six months. But I just, I don't know. It, it just, I lost the love for it. Um, some people are just, I guess, really great at streaming and can constantly, I guess, be that up uppity personality that you need i just can't i i'm too first off i'm like <laughs> the biggest introvert ever i don't i don't know it, it was just like constantly being i guess a hundred percent to a stream for like two to four hours was just way way too draining like, I give respect to all those who stream because I, I wouldn't, I, I, I couldn't, obviously. I took a big break. But I still do enjoy um, recording and making videos. I don't think that's a passion that I will ever lose just because I just find so much fun. Even though my edits aren't the biggest or like the most extravagant, I'm not really good at editing, I'll admit. But I do have like... A little passion for it that um, I just hope turns out well so once again thank you for all those who did support my my streaming days but I think it will be a long time before we see that again anywho anywho let's go to the rat explore the haunted house north of the graveyard heavy door oh we can just go in no lock uh hello hands <laughs> oh. As you walk through the dilapidated estate, the temperature drops drastically. The floorboards and walls groan angrily, as if the whole building is upset at your invasion. <laughs> invasion? A gust of wind suddenly rushes up the staircase, as though the house itself was drawing breath. An ear-splitting scream stirs dust from the ra rafters and makes your knees weak. Ah, that's definitely the melodious, melodious, me melodious voice of a banshee, or I'm a chicken's aunt. <laughs> I mean, you got the feathers for it. 
You take a step forward, but ghostly, skeletal hands rise up through the creaking floorboards. They reach out, grasping, and you feel your spirit fade at their frigid touch. You're all lucky I misplaced my specter sickle, or I'd cut you down like weeds. Guess I should report back to the gravekeeper anyway. Ah, we need to go upstairs. Oh, your foot falls again and conjures many grasping spectral hands, clutching and scratching so as to keep you from going any further. I'll need some help from the gravekeeper to calm these grabby ghosts. My bad, my bad, my bad. I just wanted to investigate. What would the gravekeeper have? All he does is dig. Why would he have anything special? Can't we just make something? We've made glitter bombs. We've made cake. We can't make a specter signal to cut off ghostly hands? You're back! It's a demon from the underworld, isn't it? Oh, or maybe a lich come to something come to summon up an army of darkness. Relax, it's just your run of the mill banshee. A banshee? I knew it! No wonder the dead have been so angry lately. How are they supposed to get any rest with all this racket? Hmm. But a spirit only becomes a banshee when it's been terribly wronged. Who used to live in that house? I don't rightly know. It's been abandoned since before my time. Always always was pretty creepy, though. The place was so haunted that I couldn't get in for a better look. A good exorcism ought to clean it right up! This sort of stuff happen often? Haha! <laughs> Why, just last year I had to deal with a ghoul that wouldn't stop breaking into the grips. Darn feller was trying to find his lost love or something. The old man turns to rummage through his cluttered shack, looking for something. Anyways, eventually I had to call in the grave grave squad exterminators. <laughs> they got that nasty ghoul rounded up before he befouled too many tombs. But they left behind this, uh, where did it get to? Aha! They gave me this to ward off any angry spirits that might be left over. He holds up a rusty-looking lantern. A ghost lamp. I thought those things got recalled because of all those possessions. Uh, I never heard nothing about that. Now, this thing ain't powerful enough for banshees, but it should keep the lesser spirits away. He gives the lamp a shake, but only a puff of purple smoke rises off the wick. Ah, jeez. Looks like I forgot to keep it fueled up. I'd go get the gas myself, but the graveyard in this state he shrugs feebly at you you're hopeless <laughs> what does the ghost lamp need for fuel he squints at the fading label on the back of the lantern let's see batwing ghostly ectoplasm crypt crawler silk that's crazy I don't remember how to get any of that <laughs> I think the bat wings actually oh if I could just remember the, there we go. The bat wings. I think we just needed bait on a stick. Yeah, dragonflies and bats, and I could craft one of those. Do I need to craft more than one? Eagle! <gasps> there you are. Ready for some nummies? Nice. One! Just one? How many do I need? Three. Frick! What, what's the button? Oh my gosh. I, uh, G? No, that's not it. H. I need to remember that. Um, I can make one more. Put that here. And then... Crypt Crawler Silk. I feel like we've gotten that before. It's just remembering how we got it. This? Arachnicide. It was definitely this. And I need to go to the swamp. Yippee! Oh, now you drop two. Okay, all right. That's fair. Thanks, game. Oh, another update. <laughs> As if you guys care. <laughs> I got new headphones. I don't know. I don't wear like over the ear headphones, so I guess earbuds. I got these, and they're comparing to the price and how well they are. They're pretty nice. They're like they were like mm, like fifty bucks, and they wrap around your ear and they go in your ear, obviously, and they're quite. Um, apparently people use it for music and whatnot. No, 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 My, no, I don't need dragonflies, thank you. Too tough to break a hand with all- Then use the scissors in your hands, you old little hag. How do I find a new- Was it- This? Yeah. Alright, cool. Here you go. 
eat that, please? Oh, please, before the... <laughs> there we go. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, okay, so Arachnicide was right here. There. Oh, I need more thistle. Frick. There we go. Oh, but the mesquites are in the way. Excuse me, excuse me, sorry. I'm so- Oh! <laughs> Can I get that one last one, please? <laughs> please? Just a- Just a little- Oh! <laughs> please! Come on, be nice. I'll give you my blood later. You don't want it, it tastes bad. Do I even have blood? I got bird feet, bird hands, a cauldron head. What even am I? Like a little gremlin. Uh, arachnosai. Okay, hopefully we don't have to craft two of these. Should I craft a second one just in case? I think I should. So let me make another bait stick if I can even. I can. Okay, so let's go find another one. And then I need to definitely craft or get more thistle. We are low on thistle today. You too? Why is everyone near the thistle? <laughs> please, please, please. Ah! <laughs> no. Okay, we're safe. Dude, I am the perfect dodger. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, there's that troll. Okay. I still haven't figured out what the troll is for. The troll's probably gonna be for the other four chapters, because I know I think there's like 12 chapters total. So I think he's part of it. Did a... No, a newt didn't spawn. Gosh dang it! Wasting my time! Oh, here we go. Come on, come on. Give me a newt! Give me a newt! Hey, let's go! Are you hungry? Would you like a tasty snack? That's for you. Eat up. Yummy. <laughs> the fact that he just implodes. That's crazy. All right, that should be enough for another set of arachnicide. Cause I, yeah, there we go. I don't even know if we'll need it, but I'll just, I'll just leave the potion like that. Cause I don't know if you can use that potion for anything else, but just in case, I might save myself on materials. Oh, they do respawn, that's cool. Come here, spider, 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 spider. I got your favorite. You better drop too. I don't want to waste materials. I'm stingy. Uh, hey, there you go. You want this? D ah, take it! Oh, <laughs> you do drop too. And you drop bug iker, 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 icher. I'm gonna call it icher from now on. Or itcher. Itcher? Ooh, that sounds gross. But. We got everything that the Gravekeeper needs. Apparently all this is gonna refuel stuff, even though one of them is ectoplasm, which is wet, isn't it? So like, how does something wet- I guess wet is fuel, right? You don't- uh, I'm not- I'm not even gonna fathom how this works. Eagle! Gosh, are you dying? He squints at the fading label- oh, yes, yes, okay. Batwing. The webbed wings still flap of their own accord! What?! Uh, sure? Uh, the crypt crawler's silk is thick and smells oddly of lilac. That's pretty. And ectoplasm. The phantom goo feels as if it's attempting to pull you down beneath the soil. Uh, this is a home safety hotline. I seem to have misplaced my reading glasses, so maybe you better prepare the mixture. You read off the well-worn instructions printed on the lantern. They are horridly confusing and riddled with spelling mistakes. How did these contraptions ever make it to the market in the first place? You better stand back. If I do this wrong, things might get a little... explodey. <laughs> you grind together the gruesome ingredients to a waxy paste before rendering the whole mixture down over the gravekeeper's cooking fire. The odor coming from the wet bubbling soup makes the hairs in your nose prickle! Ugh. But you power through it and pour the ghastly oil into the lantern with a rusty funnel. The gravekeeper raises one caterpillar-like eyebrow at you. No kaboom! Perfect! Give her a good shake. You swish the oil around inside the lamp and light the wick. Slowly, a bluish, unearthly glow fills the space around you. Take it! I didn't read that part. Take a look at that! Fresh as a daisy. 
just wave it around. Uh, should do any wayward ghoulies try to cross accost you? What? It should clear the way to that miserable banshee. If in maybe you can ask her what all this, what all the fuss is about. If it? What is if in? W what is the word if in? Did I read that right? Well, it doesn't matter now. Oh, there's a well here. I could collect some water. I could collect water here. Oh, what's this? Okay. Got a little outhouse. This is a nice place. You could revamp it. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah. I got important business to do. Everyone leave. I'm going to take your bones and I'm going to leave. You got any more stuff? Huh? Huh? Getting on my nerves over here. Yeah. Get out of here. Tired of all y'all. Okay. <laughs> I think we found the banshee, guys. Oh, look at her. Oh, she's weird. Chill out, lady. Put a muzzle on it. Scree! Come to taunt me as well. You're beautiful. Taunt you? I've come to find why you're throwing such a tantrum. You raise the dead with your wailing. Wah! The wraith's jaw drops to her collarbone, howling as her ghostly arms reach for you. You quickly raise the ghost lamp high, bathing the room in cold light. The spirit recoils away, covering her eyes with translucent hands. Yay! It burns! Why do you torment me so? Oh, quit being so dramatic. Now tell me what's got you so upset. It's gone! That sneak, that thieving, plague-ridden rodent stole it! What's gone? Who stole it? My family's crypt was defiled by that wretched rat! My most precious treasure! My brooch! It's gone! I will not rest until I have it back! Ah, uh, that rat stole the brooch from your crypt. That's enough to make anyone upset. Yes! It was stolen! <laughs> Ripped from my breast! Where has it gone? Well, if the rat pilfered it off your remains, maybe he left behind a clue as to where he ran off to. But that crypt is jammed full of caskets. How will I know which box is yours? What was your name? I do not remember. Who was I? Everything is clouded by my suffering. Well, this is how this was your house, right? There must be some relics in here that can point me in the right direction. Okay, okay, I get it. I'll get to the bottom of this. Then you can stop all this howling. My throat! Okay. Yep, that's exactly what I was doing. Search the haunted house for clues about the banshee. The family crest. Position in the family. Order of death? What? Oh, there's something. This corro- Can you shut up? This corroded picture frame has almost completely deteriorated. You can barely make out ghostly figures sitting together on the rotten canvas. A shame. Time has almost forgotten this family. Maybe I can restore it. Restore just this little piece of them. Huh? Huh? Ah, re restore- Ah! Restorative idol for the destroyed portrait. Okay. How do we make that? Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Alright. That's one done. Alright, what's next? Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> dang it! I think we need these for- Yeah, we do. How many of the pumpkin jack bones do we need? Just one? Okay. And then we can make that. How do we make this? We have enough for this. Okay. Alright. Uh, let me find- <laughs> so funny. Whoa. This heavy box seems like it might contain important family documents, but it's locked tight. Hmm. I doubt the key is anywhere around here. I better just make my own. Ah! Skeleton key. Oh, isn't that what we use for the pube guy? Oh, we can make that easily. Uh, let's use that now? Oh, I need to go in my inventory. 
Let's uh put uh, this there. Uh, okay. There you go. No, 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 no. I already have it. There we go. Yep, that's how you use a key. You crack open the chest to find a collection of multi papers and bills, but a heavy book at the bottom looks promising. In the cracked leather bound tome, you browse through long forgotten obituaries, and we mourn her death, the third siblings the third of her siblings to pass. Much beloved, she will long be remembered for her beautiful singing voice. Yeah, beautiful. And tireless pursuit of justice. Sounds like our banshee, the third to die. That'll mean that her casket will be the third one in her row. You better remember that, because I got other stuff to do still. Shut up. You got anything in your room? I didn't even bother to check. What is that? Are you practicing witchcraft too? My goodness, does anyone here act normal? Jeez. Oh, maybe that was her. Pretty. She was pretty girl. Oh, uh, crest. Crest. Mm, is there a crest in here? There is. That's a crest? That's a shield. The embossed shield looks like it might be a coat of arms, but the face is so badly encrusted with patina? Patina? What is that word? That you can't quite make out what it is. Hmm. A good cleaning ought to get this looking spick and span. Water purification recipe. That's new. Uh, ectoplasm? Who gives ectoplasm? You guys don't give ectoplasm. To, oh, I can't see him. Which ghost do you give? No, you give tears. I think you give tears. But this, this dope gives ectoplasm. Exorcism charm. Oh, uh, here. More bad wings. Okay. Can I do bat wings out here? Please tell me there's like bats out here. You got bats? No, that's a bird. No bats. Got it. <laughs> Fine, I'll go out here. Cause what else would give ectoplasm? I know one of them gives tears. Another one gives. Uh, I don't remember. Doesn't one of them like give like a skull? Him, what does he give? I don't think he'll give ectoplasm. Oh, he's mean too. What a guy. What a guy. Don't come near me. I'm doing my own thing. I'm not bothering you. I'm gonna bother the other guy. Now where's that one ghost? Well, I guess I could just go back up. He should give ectoplasm, right? Because I don't remember. I know the crying one gives tears. I think the head one just gives a skull. I just don't remember it and my nose is bothering me. Yeah, he gives ectoplasm. Thank you! So, that's all I need for this, right? Sweet. And this is still... yeah. Once I get the pumpkin jack, we'll be good. Let me clean this first. Excuse me! Don't hurt me! You clean away the grit and grime to reveal a proud lion staring back at you. This crest looks like it matches one of the burial rooms in the crypt. Alright, so lion... Lion room, and then door number, or tomb number three. Why are we going to her body? I guess to figure out who she is. Oh, because the rat might have left a clue. What kind of person goes through dead bodies? Imagine the- he must have pilfered through his sister- her sisters too. I can't imagine going into a crypt and robbing dead people. That sounds weird! I don't understand. Like, is it worth it? Is it really worth it? Who's gonna buy that? Not me! I wouldn't buy that. You got that from a dead body? That's not my problem. Unless it was inherited. Ooh, little cricket. It the bit. Thanks. Hello. Have I ever talked to you? Good day to you. Good day to you. You know you have pumpkin jacks in here. Yeah, come at me. Come at me. I like to fight them out here. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Loser. Did you? There we go. All right, that's all we needed, right? If I remember correctly, that is not what I'm making. I'm making this. So we 
right. Now I get to walk all the way back. Oh, what is this? When do we use it? What? A pheasant, not entirely unlike a chicken, though to the aesthetic preference of some. They're cute. We can't even interact with it. Pheasants are pretty. You know what my favorite chicken is? A silky chicken. Those are some pretty chickens. My grandparents have chickens. And I think it is so much fun to go in there and mess with them. Not mess with them. Not like abuse them. I mean like hold them and like pet them. I don't. There, there'll be no reason for me to bother a chicken any other way. She gets it so cool. It's like the only bird I'm not afraid to like touch because they're not gonna do anything. I will. You can't catch me touching a parrot. A parrot scares me. You see those beaks they have? Giant pointy beaks. Ain't no way you're gonna catch me touching a parrot. But a chicken. I will pet a chicken any day. I will hold a chicken any day. I think I have a photo of me holding a chicken. Excuse me. Uh, was it here? This thing. Here we go. Color and light flooded back into the faded painting to reveal a content looking family. You recognize one of the younger girls by her shock of hair. Oh, so her hair was always like that? <laughs> and a brooch on her chest. That must be our wailing wraith. A granddaughter by the looks of it. So she must be on the lower tiers of the crypt. Okay. I think that's everything I need to know. The banshee's body is buried under the crest of the lion. She's a granddaughter, so she'll be on the bottom row. And she was the third one to pass away. Ah, you do save it for me. Thank you. And that's the crypt with the spiders? I had no idea that that was going to be used. Buggy! Oh, what? What? Hey, uh, oh, uh, oh, you're back! Find out anything about our predicament? It seems like you've got a grave robber on the loose. The banshee had a brooch stolen from her family crypt. A grave robber? Oh, dang, those despicable degenerates. With these, with the increase in ghosts, I haven't been able to do my nightly patrols. I need to get back to the crypt and find her body. The thief might have left something behind. Well, good luck. That place has more spiders than I have liver spots. <laughs> so you'll understand if I stay behind. Yeah, I wasn't expecting you to come, uh, buddy. I wasn't even expecting you to talk to me. I was kind of just, you know, doing my own thing. Going on my own two feet. That is not it. Uh, here we go. Yeah, see ya. Wish me luck. Even though I don't believe in luck. Alright, lion. Oh, that's the piggy. Okay, uh, that's an owl. Mmm, lion. Bottom row, third one. No. Well, it's not in any of these. No way. Here it is. You dig your nails underneath the loose plaque and begin to pull. The rusty bolts pop off the corners of the end cap as the whole thing rips off from the mossy wall. You toss away the grave cover and peer inside the dark hollow holding of your lamp aloft. Uh, dozens of small beady eyes blink back at you! Rats! You quickly jump aside as, tor as a torrent of vermin come pouring out of from the coffin. Filthy little bl biters! Come to pill for more graves! Squeaking and hissing, they flow like some lumpy liquid rushing back towards the entrance. You get the feeling that these rats are far more organized than a normal than any normal pest. Where are you off to, little devils? Running back to your master, perhaps? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh I mean that's kind of satisfying. Oh, you ruined it! You ruined it! Uh, why did it say I can like investigate these? I guess they thought I was gonna be stupid, huh? Oh, stop! Leave me alone. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm faster than you. <laughs> I'm faster. Where y'all going? Huh? Hurry up! Come on! I want to follow you. You're taking forever. Look, I'll stay on the side, okay? You're gross. Gross. Okay, you guys are leaving. What? Oh, follow their nest in the graveyard. I thought it was like in the crypt. Where are y'all going, huh? <laughs> They're so cute, though! Why are their tails so long? They got long tails. It's like little worms just coming out of their butts. Y'all got tapeworm? Oh. You track the swarm of rats into thorny bramble, their bodies whirling in a verminous mass. 
This does not, however, seem to be their permanent nest. If you could only flush them out, perhaps they would flee to their true source. A good spark ought to set this dry tinder alight. Can't hide from me, beast. We're gonna set this on fire? I mean, there's a big tree here. He's kind of hanging out. Are you sure you want to do this? Cinder box. Oh, man. When was the last time we made a cinder box? Was that like when we dealt with the bear? Jeez. Here you go. Keep moving. The brush is quickly subsumed in tongues of flame, scattering the rats beneath. Their frenzy route is not without order, though. Though. I can't English. I'm sorry. In a wave of fur and claws, they scramble through the graveyard towards their next hiding place. Where are you going? Why must you give me such a hard time? Oh, I'm mermaid. I never realized that. In here? You guys going in here, huh? Oh, that's a yes. The horde of rats pour between the bars of this crumbling mausoleum, swirling in a... a swirling in a what? Gyre? Gyre? Was it like gyrosphere? So gy... Just out of reach. Once more, they have found a temporary refuge. Such a closed-in space seems ripe for a good smoking. They won't be able to hold their breath for so long. All right, let's bring out that Kush. Let's bring out that 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 smoky doopy. Let's bring out that wacky backy. Uh. Be back you guys chill out you know oh more of you are coming just oh, okay i'll be back i got my smoke I'm going home to smoke the rats. Da 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 once more, they rush forth, this time fleeing towards the shadow of the ruined church. There's a church here? Where? Where is there a church? What? I. Where are you guys? Where are you guys going? Oh! Wow! Look at here! The flood of the rats squeeze through the bars of a great brass gate and disappear into the ruins of a squat abandoned church. Heavy chains. Heavy chain binds up the gate. Is that English? Can I not English or is that not English? Heavy chain? I guess so. If it's just one long chain. Heavy chain. No, that doesn't sound right. Heavy chain binds up the gate. And the rusted padlock is well beyond accepting any sort of key. Something more potent will be needed to open it. Acidic? What is that? <laughs> I feel like this episode is really proving how long it's been. I can't... Unjuent? Unjuent. Acidic unjuent? Is that... I'm just stupid. <gasps> hey, look at that! See? See? This is why I save things. I gotta get weird water. I can make a jar. I can make a jar! Looky here! I don't have to run so far! Ah, oh, you see? It's all coming together. It's all coming together. Unjuance. Unjuance. That's a word? Why do I feel so stupid? You see, this is why I should have stayed in college. I, I did- I, I'm not a college dropout. I will say that. I didn't mean it like that. No offense to all the people who dropped out of college. Some of them are really successful. I'm just saying, you know, I got my associates, okay? I got my associates. And then I stopped because, you know, it wasn't fun anymore. Unjuin. Let's, let's just make some. Oh no, let's make some weird water. All right, all right. Now we make a. All right, all right, all right. We're making something. Oh. Uh, the iron of the padlock wheezes in protest as it melts away into a blackened goo. The chain, the chain falls away, and you push open the gate into to the churchyard beyond. Oh, Ain't this night place so nice and pretty? Let me just uh, do my rounds, you know. You got any chests for me? No, of course not. 
I mean, it's a rat. It's a thief that's having it, right? He's not gonna have anything out in the open. Uh, what's going on? Wow. Should I call TLC? Because this is like a whole hoarder. You got bee boxes. Why do you have bee boxes here? <gasps> a chest for me. Oh, I'm such a thief. He, me and him are both thieves. We can relate. Why are there so many bee boxes? Oh, another chest. Money? I got money? I'm rich now? Find the rats. I'm here. What? This? You attempt to pick up the candlestick, but find it attached to some mechanism inside the altar. A latch flips, and you watch a stack of boxes slide aside to reveal a hidden crack in the wall. Is this a Hercupoloid? Reminds me of Hercupoloid with the, what, the priest was hiding the actual paintings. Hello? Whoa, look at all this cash. Oh, oh, oh and there he is. <laughs> you goober, don't you know that thieving is wrong? Oh my gosh, what are you going to even do with all this? You can't use it. That's another thing I thought about. It's just like, you can't, I mean, after a long, long time, but isn't it like you just can't use what you recently stole because it would be logged as stolen and people would look out for it? I don't know. Hello. Oh. You're uh, an interesting creature. Hey, who in the blazes are you? What you? Who let you in, huh? I let myself in. You should really hide your secret lair a bit better. Though I must admit, this is quite the collection you've acquired here. Why, what's it to you? You looking to make a trade? We've got whatever you need, sister. If you could pay the price, that is. As a matter of fact, I'm looking for an old antique brooch, and I heard you're the one to talk to. Yeah, we got plenty of brooches. Any of these beauties catch your eye? The vermin flips open his cloak, and you see it's lined with rows of, and rows of jewelry. Just, hey! You lean in for a closer look. The items all look like priceless family heirlooms, but you can't pick out the one belonging to the banshee. Hmm, I'm not sure. I'll need to confer with my friend as to which is the right one. The rat narrows his eyes suspiciously, suspiciously and hides his wares back inside his cloak. And just who is this friend of yours? Why, she's the original owner, of course. She would very much like her property returned to her. No deal. We don't make trades with the dead. But you're happy enough to steal from them. Let me just go tell my friend where your little hideout is. I'm sure she'll be more persuasive than myself. Fool! This place is sacred ground! No bad spirits can enter here! Now get out before we pick you clean! Alright, alright. No need to be crass. Boy, you stinky little loser! This brooch is mine, get out. Whatever! Return to the church altar. Are we gonna have to actually walk back? I guess so. To figure out what it is. Well, what did it have like a like a lion on it? I don't know. No spirits may cross the threshold, eh? Well, then I'll just have to invite one in myself. You eye out, you eye the flat surface of the barren altar. It looks like the perfect place to conduct a séance. We can do that, spirit born recipe. What do you mean? What do you? What do you mean? What is this? Wicked gemstone. Dog hair! Oh my gosh, when was the last time we even got dog hair? Necrotic charm again! Uh, well, <laughs> I'm about to be a busy lady. Okay, you stupid little rat. That did not take as long as I thought it would. I mean, I use my brain like this one that doesn't know English but knows how to do the rest. Um, I managed to actually make it work. So there we go. Didn't take as long. I got the stupid demon thing and do I invoke it here? Right here? Is here fine? Gosh, please don't tell me I wasted it. Okay. Close your eyes and place your hands on the planchette of the spirit board. Concentrating hard, you try to focus your thoughts towards the haunted mansion. Hello? Can you hear me? Show me a sign. The planchette begins to twitch and move, slowly tracing out the letters on the board. Who is this? Oh, come on now. Who else would it be? I'm calling to let you know I found where the rat is. You might want to come down here and speak to him. The lights flicker within the halls and dim down until you are drenched in total darkness. Only a blood-red glow throbs from the altar. 
wind rushes through the church and you can hear the squealing rats as they dive for cover. On the gale comes the screams of the dead reverberating through the halls. The spirit board shudders and splits with the noise and a skeletal hand claws its way out from the people of the cracked planchette. Eee! He is here! I can smell him! Right? Through the crack in the wall, actually. The vengeful spirit howls and flies straight through your body as she sweeps down into the rat's hideout. Brr, that's chilly. Wait for me, I need to see how this ends. <laughs> that's so funny. I want to see, I want to see. She's in it for the tea. Hello. Hello. Oh. <laughs> you, you dare take from me. How did you? Wait, it was just a simple misunderstanding. I didn't. Even your hour of judgment, you lie. The rat's bulging eyes look onto you in desperation. This is your doing, isn't it? You let her in here. I'm merely helping to settle a dispute. You thought all your grave robbing wouldn't come with consequences? Face justice for your crimes, thief! The dead will have come for you! The manchi whirls around like a hurricane, drawing with her an innumerable, innumerable host of ghosts and spirits. No, no! Get off us, you wretches! You were dead! Finders keepers! Spectral claws grab onto the rat and his verminous minions and drag them squealing into the underworld. <laughs> Dang! With the crack of thunder, the howling wind evaporates. Not a single rat remains. A calm falls over the banshee as she reaches down and picks up one of the scattered brooches left on the floor. My, my brooch. It's back. It's safe. I, I can finally sleep. She clutches her treasure onto her breast and looks at you with a final crooked smile before fading away in a glimmer of ghostly smoke. In the eerie silence of the cave, you see something squirming in the debris. Oh! Oh! What is it? I don't want it! No! No! I don't want it! I don't want it! Keep it! It's good! No! It's gross! What is that? Oh, you brush aside some pilfered treasure and uncover a writhing mass of pink rat tails tangled together like worms. Ugh, looks like they got all knotted up trying to escape the soul of the rat. <laughs> yes, finally, the rat. So can we like, can we like take some of this stuff? Can we like, I, I kind of want to just. Put it in my pocket a little bit, please. A little bit. I actually want to talk to the grave, grave runner, grave, grave keeper. The grave keeper. I want to talk to the grave keeper first. Because sometimes, oh, there's ghosts here. <laughs> Look at all that. Are there any more down here? Oh, there is. Um, because some, there's like a little bit of aftermath talking that there is. And I forgot to do that with the ox. And I did it the episode after. But I do believe maybe he'll talk to us or maybe he'll just ignore us and act like we did nothing to help him, you know, not gonna work. And the next one is the fish. The fish one is cool. Hey, can I talk to you? Finally, some peace around here. Really? Peace? They're still kinda, you know what, I'm not even gonna bother with it. But next one will be the um, fish. Like I said, because, you know, I have to repeat things to make it make sense. Um, but yeah, this is, I guess, the end of my first recording after a while. It's so weird to be, I guess, back. Um, because obviously to you guys, I don't think I've ever left. I want to say thank you guys so much for watching um, and enjoying another episode. Uh, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. I don't even ask for that. And I know there's some loyal people out there who still do it. And I appreciate you all. Um... Yeah, just thank you so much, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye, bye. Bye.